Good day, my lovely peepees at home. I hope you are all doing well. Once again, you are welcome to today's class. I am teacher Rita Asemota. And today, I will be taking us on Home Economics Primary 5. Home Economics Primary 5. In our previous class, we learned what a family is. And we also talked about the different types of family. Today, we are looking at roles of each member of the family. Now we already know what a family is and the various types of families. We are looking at the roles of each member of the family. Each member has some specific functions or role they play in the family. Meaning, there are things you are to do as a child in the family. There are things the mother, of, the mother in the house is supposed to do. And there are things the father of the house is supposed to do. Today we'll be looking at few of them. The first one we're taking here is the role of the father in the family. Now, we all know from our childhood, we start teaching us like, the father is the head of the home. The father is the head of the family. That is the first role of the father. The father is the head of the family, meaning the father takes charge in the family. Number two, it provides the basic family needs. What are the basic family needs? It provides a house. It provides clothes. And it also provides what? Food for the family. That is the responsibility of the father. Now, the father also provides education and medical care. It is the responsibility of our father, that is our daddy at home, to provide money to take care of our school fees, to take care of our medical bills, to pay the house rent or to build a house for us, to buy us clothes and give our mommy money to go to the market and buy food stuff and make sure there is food in the house. That's the responsibility of the father. Also, the father is also saddled with the responsibility of what good behavior, showing good examples to the children. He's saddled with that responsibility. He also presents himself as a good citizen by what paying his tasks in the society. These are some of the roles of the father. Now, we go to the role of the mother, the mother, your mommy. If I ask you now, you all know what your mommy do at home. I know what my mommy do. I know what my mommy do. Now, the role of the mother. The first responsibility of the mother is that she bears children. She bears children. Who gave birth to you? Your mother. You say, my mommy. And some of you will say, oh, I, like, I love my mommy more than my daddy. I love my daddy more than my mommy. Now, it happens because of some certain things that the parents do for their children. Now, the mother is saddled with the responsibility to do what? To bear children in the family. Secondly, she cooks for the family. She cleans the house. She takes care of the children. These are the responsibility of what? The mother. She also teaches the children good behavior. She teaches the children how to wash clothes. She teaches, she teaches them how to clean the house, how to sweep, sit right, how to sit right, especially the female. The mother has a lot of responsibilities. She teaches the children how to cook. When, when the mother is in the kitchen, she call you, come join me in the kitchen, give me salt, give me oil, and all of that, and you are watching. What are you doing? You are being taught how to cook. So the, these are the roles of the mother. Not only that, the mother also contributes to the family income by working. She does not just sit at home and wait for the father to bring money at all times. She also works and she does what she contributes. She brings in her money into the family, add it to that of the father, and what happens? They put it together and the children are taken care of. Now we move to the roles of the children. As a child in the family, you also have some role to play. Number one, you obey your parents. Children are to obey their parents. Very, very necessary. Obedience to their parents. Now, they also bear the family name. The children bear the family name. 
You don't leave your family and go and answer another person's family. So it is the role of the children to bear the family name. The children help in house chores. A lot of us do our house chores. We do a lot of house chores. Some of us can sweep. Some of us can wash clothes. Some of us can wash plates. Some of us can wash our parents' cars. So these are the roles of the children. Also, the older children have to take care of the younger ones at home. As a child, you are the eldest in the family and you have younger ones. You can help your parents out by helping to take care of them, clean them up, bait them, give them clothes to wear, set their food on the table, and all of that. Children are also to take care of their parents at old age. When your parents grow older and you are now an adult, you are supposed to take care of your parents. These are the roles, some of the roles, not all, of the father, the mother, and the children. Now, when each member of the family perform their duties very well, you know your duty and you perform it very well, what happens? The family moves forward. There will be what? Peace. And there will be what? Progress in the family. I hope you enjoyed today's class. Don't forget to do the homework. Remain blessed. Bye for now.